An Air Force veteran is struggling in health these days, but looking to make memories in his final days. One last trip he wanted to make is to tour Tyndall Air Force Base. News 13's Taylor Rambo tonight tells us how Team Tyndall made his final wish come true. Tyndall Air Force Base holds a special place in Air Force veteran Daniel Dalby Sr.'s heart. My first assignment after I graduated from pilot training was right here in 1952. 95-year-old Dalby was recently diagnosed with pancreatic cancer and wanted to get back to a place where his career first took off. I started my career here and had a wonderful journey and I'm, re and I'm going to pass away here. With a little help from his son and officials on base, they were able to get him back on board. The Air Force has been his life. We've grown up on many bases and uh, today will probably be one of the most important days of his life. Colonel Brian Laidlaw giving Dalby a private tour on base on Wednesday. The thing I was uh, looking forward to most was to meet that, where, that gentleman right there. <laughs> I wanted to meet him so bad. And Laidlaw feeling a similar way. I know that from his perspective it's a treat for him, but I will say it is equally a treat for us to be able to entertain uh, 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 heroes from his generation. Dobby reflecting on his time spent on base and in the Air Force and leaving one message to current active duty airmen. Be true to your mission. Be true to your mission. And, and do it because you want to do it and, and you like doing it. At Tyndall Air Force Base, Taylor Rambo, News 13, Panhandle Strong.